Are you targeting the right market? Do you, do you even know who your target market is? Do you even know how to go and get your target market? You know, how do you get specific on who you're trying to sell to? It doesn't matter what product you've got across, you know, um, in internet marketing. We just, sometimes we sort of think that our product or service is really good for everyone, right? Um, but the fact is that most people don't want to know about your product or your service, okay? Not everyone wants to learn how to make money online. Not everyone wants to lose weight, you know? A lot of people want to be lazy. So how do you, how do you actually go and find out who your target market is, okay? How do you get really specific and get into the nitty gritty of who your target market was? Because I, I know for a long time, because I failed, and I knew, I knew about the target market, right? Excuse me, it's a bit warm. Um, I knew about the target market, right? But I never knew really how to get specific on my target market. And I was asked several times, you know, what what my target market was. And I, I thought, you know, everyone was my answer. You know, everyone wanted to get online and make money. You know, wouldn't it be awesome if everyone wants to come online and make money? But the, the sad fact is that not everyone wants to, right? But... How, how did I make the change from everyone, you know, trying to cast a net over every single person on the planet, then, you know, just pointing my arrow in the right direction and, and targeting a certain amount of people, okay? You know, you might think it's a bit silly, you know, going from, you know, a million people in a demographic, like, you know, all men, let's, let's say all men, and then, and then squashing that right down to all men who are 18 to 35. Right, so you might think that's a bit silly, you know, aren't I, aren't I limiting, you know, the amount of people who I'm talking to? But what happens is that I'm guaranteeing that I'm going to get more, more sign-ups or sales, you know, across the board compared to, you know, the more people. But you might be thinking, well, that sounds a bit silly. But the thing is that I'm marketing to a specific type of person, okay? So as Kim, Kim Claver says, um, if you can call that, call them out by name, right? Then they will answer. And sorry, Kim, if you ever see this, I, I'm not sure if that is, you know, the exact quote from the book. But um, what she's trying to say is, right? So if you walk into a room of people and you say, "Hey, Jim," and you know, all the gyms put their name up, put their hand up, you know, that's that's your target market, you know. But calling those people out by name. So if you're able to call out everyone by name, all those people in front of you are going to buy. And that's that's how it works, right? So that's what we mean by having a target market, okay? So if you're out there trying to cast your net over everyone, you're, you're going to end up, you know, selling to no one. You know, like like Tracy Walker says, um, if, you're, if you're marketing to everyone, you're marketing to no one, okay? And it's pretty true. Like, I, I tried to market to everyone. You know, I thought, I thought everyone wanted to make money online. I thought everyone wanted, you know, particular products and stuff. But it's the, the fact is that not everyone wants to lose weight, you know. Not everyone wants to build muscle. Um, I know myself, I don't want to lose weight. I don't want to, you know, I don't want to, you know, build heaps of muscle. So, you know, no one wants to be Arnold Schwarzenegger. You know, not everyone wants to be anyway. Okay. So, how, right, so how do I do it? Okay, how do I actually change from trying to market to everyone to actually market to a specific niche. It's not just a specific niche, but it's a specific like genre within the niche. You know? How do I market to that name? How do I find my name that I can call out and just make sales like that? Okay. So there's there's two questions I ask myself. All right. To get really specific, okay. So what what I want you to do is after we go through one and two like Pause the video, write down, you know, your answers to your own questions. Okay, so question one, what problem does your product or service solve? Okay, what problem does your product or service solve? Okay, so what are the solutions your product or service has? Okay, what does it solve within your network marketing industry or your health niche, you know? What problem does it solve? Is it, is it a dietary pill? You know, do people lose weight? Okay. Do they put muscle on? You know, do they have a instant blog? Right? Are they able to set up a, an easy blog? Are they, you know, without knowing like HTML and stuff? 
Okay, so what problem is you need to get really specific and write it down. Okay, so I want you to write it down. What actual problem your product or service solves. All right. So then you want to know who who are the type or what what type of people need these products or solutions. Okay, so what type of people? So if it's internet marketing, you know, there's a lot of internet marketers out there, or there's new people into internet marketing, right? That need to know this stuff. Okay. There's people who need to know how to lose weight, right? Are they larger people, right? Are they, you know, I don't mean like tall like me, six foot four. I mean, you know, are they overweight, right? That's that's being getting in and getting the nitty gritty specific of, you know, who these people are. All right, question two, who has these problems and challenges, okay? So who has these problems and challenges, right? The people who need X product, right, or X service, you know, men, you know, men who want to lose weight, women who want to lose weight, you know, families maybe who want to lose weight, you know, or pregnant mothers, you know, maybe like you want to market to pregnant mothers like after they've had their child, you know, maybe they don't want to lose that baby belly, you know, if you've got a specific product for that, right? Be it goes beyond that, and you need to know what the demographics are. So, you know, if it's pregnant mothers from the ages of, you know, 30 to 40, right, who have four children, okay? So if you can get right of the demographics, you know, are they, are they age-specific? Are they baby boomers? Are they men? Are they women of a certain age, okay, of a certain weight? Maybe they're a certain height, you know? Maybe they've, maybe they've failed at university or something. You know, so if you can find exactly specifically what your target market is, okay, using your demographics, right, using using what what your product solves, you know, what problems, okay, so what your problem solves, and then what who these problem who these people are that need to have those problems, you know, solve. Um, if you work that out, um, you're going to be able to know how to call your market by name. Okay, so when you when you shout out, you're out there marketing online. So if you you know you maybe on the phone, you know, if you're out there and you ring this person and say, hey, do you know anyone that's you know interested in losing you know 30 pounds that is between the ages of 40 and 45, right? That are men. Okay, that's that's calling them out by name. And they'll go, yeah, me. I know someone like that. It's me. It's me. I, I, it's me. I want to lose weight. Okay. So that's that's knowing how to call out people's names. All right. So you just need to stop, stop doing what everyone else is doing and trying to cast a net over everyone and get really specific on who your target market is. Okay. Go and work it all out. Sit down. Take the time. Right. This is gonna the time now to actually sit down and work out who your target market is. Is going to be better than actually um, trying to go out there and just push it on everyone. Okay, so if you can get really specific, right? Sit down, write it down, find out who your target market is, and then I'll tell you how to actually go and sell to that market in the next video. Okay.